let me put it through a different perspective. This is how I looked at it. Little Nas X, I didn't even know who the fuck he was until like a month ago when I saw Nas. Mm-hmm. I was like, what's this, Nas the kid? I, you know, I didn't know. And then I'm looking at him, and I just, you know, orig- automatically, in my mind, I'm like, oh, this kid's a fucking dork. I'm going to make fun of him right away right. without even knowing who he is. He wasn't mm-hmm. even important enough to make fun of on the show. You know what I mean? I know. But when he does this song, a guy that's in a completely different genre of music, right? And whether you want to say it sucks or not, it's the fact that you brought two genres of music together, which no, equals but, money. But they didn't. But no, but they didn't. Did that's it? bullshit because Nelly did it with Tim McGraw. Over there same country. No, stop. But this is You know, what? that's a good point. Even reggae artists did that with uh, Kenny Rogers back in the day. Right. Yo, I mean, this is didn't, not um, new. Oh, Nelly, like in the 90s, they did that with Kenny Rogers and um, Nelly. I was going to say, Nelly did that with fucking... With Tim McGraw. Yeah, Tim McGraw and Nelly. Not only yeah. that, even, but there's, even a, group, there's a group, group that have an album out. Right. Well, there's a group that have an album out that's called... Uh, they have a song out called Save a uh, Horse, Ride a Cowboy. Um, uh, Big and Rich. They actually well, both have, and Harmony country, have a fucking country cowboy voice. song. Right. Everybody, I, so I feel like everybody does a cowboy new. song, bro. You know, he, both Thugs and Harmony this have a cowboy freaking, song. And it's, it's good, too. This new little spectacle, this new wart on the ass of music, oh, you yeah, know, no. is not doing anything good, not doing anything relevant, not changing anything. Bro, he the kid is different hook. than everybody else. He just did a song with exactly Billy fucking same. Ray Cyrus, okay? Uh-huh. Everybody wants and to fuck his daughter, years and ago. now he comes out out of nowhere with some kid that's right. completely different. This kid is like 16 years old. I don't know how old he really is, but he's young. And fucking, this kid with Billy Ray, who hasn't and been he a did name. Some... Right, wait, hold and they stop. just fucking made a hit, whether you like it or not. <laughs> because, you know, you know, people on an average are dumb. dumb. You know huh? uh, a country yeah. singer called Brad Paisley? Yep. I know Brad Paisley. Yeah, that, yeah really that's know. who LL, LL did a track with something called The Accidental yep. Racist. Exactly. That was back, that yeah, was back, I, I back in 2010. I, right. So well, the Nelly song was, different. was older than that. The Nelly right, Tim McGraw song was like 2007. This different. This kid is a knockoff. Not that he's different. It's that he's the only one that's in this generation of kids that did it. Of shitty mean, music, this generation of shitty I'm music. I'm just saying, we got, oh, we got Lil Zan, who we're going to talk about later too. Shitty, because he's a fucking stunad, and we're going to we're going to talk about him pulling out the gun because because uh, a heckler came to fuck with him over the Tupac comments, which he deserves, by the way. And mm-hmm. we're going to talk about him. Now, you got a whole list of kids like that guy that are that are that are hot. Shitty music. All the, all the shitty young kids. music. Yeah, and they're they all fuck? older. It's not for us. That 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 right. drama is not for any of us. We're all too old. But it that still shit. has to be but good. It's, yeah, it's not about right, being look, good. It's about to each their own life. because or... each has their own opinion. So you can't like have an opinion. Your opinion right. is fine for you, but for somebody else, it might be different. Right. So I don't even worry right. about it. If you don't like it, that's fine. And whether we like, like it, either, it or not, but... whether we like it or not, they're getting fucking hundred million views. Some of these kids. Uh, you know why I don't like that little Nas X kid? Because he uses Nas's name to right. and. And uh, to, to try to get over, like he couldn't just go. Yeah, but isn't that, that his fucking kid? No, huh? that's Are you not his kid. All? That no. kid used to run a. He used to run a a, a fan page for Nicki Minaj. No uh, like, way. Uh, like not for her, but he ran a Nicki Minaj fan page. That's what this guy did. Right. That was his claim. The guy's a good. Yeah, but like, if he did it to get himself okay. over, then he's smart. He no, put, he well, picked back off her name to fucking get to get somewhere. I'm not against him doing that. God, I don't. I don't want. Yeah, people, people, people are thinking this, thinking that Nas bit his name from this kid. That like, well, that's don't, bullshit. Don't, 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 that's bullshit. Yeah, exactly. no, but you can't put, you can't put dumb, Nas's yeah. name. Yeah, that's okay. not his fucking kid though. Huh? No, it's not. That's, not at all. But listen, listen, dude, listen. Like no joke. Remember, we're dealing with a society that is so. Dumb that when four or five seconds came out, they said, Oh, it's so nice of Kanye to put an old guy like Paul McCartney on a track. Maybe he'll finally get his big break. Fuck Paul McCartney. All <laughs> Fuck Who said all that? Y'all. Suck on the left. Oh, Pete, dude, go, go look on the internet. Two of my boys were singing that damn old dirt road 
song, and it, it, Girl, it I like that me. song. I know you hate no, it, but, but listen, I actually like it. Hear me out. Hear, hear me out. It's good though. song. Hear, hear me out, though. Hear, hear, hear me out, though. Serious. Okay? The amount of incredible artists that come into these guys' lives, I'm not even talking about on the radio, but that come into these guys' lives, that shake their hands, that have ha- brought them on stage together, that, you know, have, have shared a, a, a little piece of them, that teach them a guitar lesson, or teach them drums, those artists, that come into their lives, the fact that the radio is playing this garbage, you know, and these guys that should have that, rec- that recognition, these guys that should because they're that damn good. Right. And these are guys that my sons look at as family. This is family to them. This is everyday life to them. But then they still got to turn on the radio and listen to some nonsense about an old dirt road that that kid's never even seen. Bro, Come on, man. I, Come on. You can fuck, you 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 can have your opinion on it, and you're such an opinionated person, easy that I love getting you go. I mean, I, that's it. Right. You do the same thing to me, right. and it's a good little it's a good right, little yeah. rivalry. Well, it's a good course. dynamic. It's a good dynamic. It's a great you dynamic, know? and we do it with everything. Yeah. I love I love the back and forth because you're very very, very opinionated as I as as am I. And if we didn't, if we if we agreed to everything, it would be a very boring show. Of, They'd be very, boring. very boring. We'd They'd have boring. no listeners. <laughs> no, nobody would give a shit. But the back and forth yeah. is, is it really what has right. made the show what it has turned into, and I like that. But I'm gonna I'm gonna disagree with you on this one. I think the kid is gonna make a name for himself off this song, okay? And I think Billy Ray Cyrus is gonna revamp his career off this kid. But you know, here's the thing, man. You say that, but I, I will say this and this alone: nine days. Nine, nine days, days for what? What's in nine days? No one will exactly. ever do it again? It, it, okay. Exact, no. No, well, listen, because there was what. a group. Listen, to, hold on. I'm not done. There was a group that had a number one hit. Okay? Number one hit song from Long Island at the time in the uh, um, early 2000s when, when actually late 90s, early 2000s, right. just come out of the grunge era. We were back into this rock pop kind of style and this group nine days with the song this is the story of a girl this has been in every single playlist it's still played in every mall you walk into but i can say nine days and you have no idea what i'm talking about and that's what is going to happen in 10 years with this douchebag well i we'll talk about 10 years i mean 10 years a long time 10 Ten, years but 10 years ago I don't. I don't Tw- see little Nas X being around in ten years. Okay. Exactly. So how is he I making a name for himself? I do see Billy Ray Cyrus making, he, putting this kid over for whatever reason, and I see Billy Ray Cyrus getting money. something out of it. Because he's and not he's getting, getting something out of it too. More out of his daughters because he's not making any more money off his children. Well, you know he's what? Not on a TV wait, show wait, with his daughter anymore. Famous one? I only know the one. Is there yeah. more than one? No, okay, there, there's well, another one. She's she's on the up and coming, and their brother okay. is, I believe, the bass player for Cobra Starship. I don't know who that is. Uh, emo band. Okay, I'm sorry. I Friends don't... with Gym Class Heroes. They were uh, they were on a song with Gym Class Heroes for the Snakes on a Plane soundtrack. All right, Snake these nuts. I guess I don't know. What I do I know I'm just is that you know, <laughs> nah, just ball busting. But um. <laughs> <laughs> I got no, um, I don't know. I just, you know, fucking, I like this song. I, I give it more than nine days, and this is how we're going to test it. Next mm-hmm. week will be seven days. Okay, so next week, we're going to, I'm not going to play the song. I'm not going to do that, because everybody does a song. Okay, I'm not going to do that to you. Right. Okay, I may play a, a, a five-second clip of the song to fuck with you. Right. I'm not going to lie. Fine. It's very possible it could happen. <laughs> but. I'm sure. And, and it could happen, but. I don't hate this song. I like it. Chris Rock got on it. You know what I mean? Just to talk shit in the video. It was obviously funded very high. Okay? For whatever reason, this is the song they picked. This is the kid they because, picked. This is the new Golden because, Boy. Because it's all... It's not a Golden Boy. It's not a Golden Boy. It's just this is the industry. This is what the industry does. And there's proof of it. 